Okay, next we go to this one, to the verb. To the verb together with all this pronoun. So we have also learned some of this in the previous lesson. Okay, we have learned, I believe we have learned here until this verb, right? Until uh, how to say I study, you study and so on. But today, uh, this is the one that I added, I just added here. So again, this is to say we. Uh, how do you say we? Then we have that word again, which is nah, no. Nah, no. All right. So with that, let us go through all the pronouns and together with the verbs again. Okay. So this is the pronoun. First, you want to say Anna. So the word is to go. So you want to say I go. So what do we say? We say Anna Azhabu. Anna Azhabu. Okay. You can repeat after me. Anna Azhabu. Anna Azhab. Anna Azhab. Yes, Azhab. Yes, good. You can read Azhabu or you can just say Azhab. Yes, that is correct. So Anna Azhab. I go or I am going. So this word, it can be go or it can be you are doing. I am going. So you can use it for both present, simple present tense and also for continuous present, present continuous tense. Okay. So you say Anna Azhabu. Okay, good. That is the first verb. We go for the second verb. The second verb you want to say I study. Okay, this is the word. Aderusu. 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 Yes, aderusu. So we combine with Anna. We say Anna aderusu. Okay, Anna aderusu. Or you can also say Anna aderus. Uh, we skip the last sound. Anna Adrus. Anna Adrus. Anna Adrus. Yes, good. Anna Adrus. Okay, so now you have two verbs. Anna Azhab, Anna Adrus. Okay, so please remember this verb because you are going to use this verb in your, in your video. Uh, okay, you will have one uh, individual video project where we will combine several lessons. So you make a simple video recording uh, about yourself using all these words. All right. Okay. I will talk about that later when we have completed three lessons. So far, we are in the second lesson. Okay. All right. Uh, adros. Adros, I study. Okay. So two verbs. The next verb. The next verb. Okay. This one. You want to say I drink or I am drinking. Okay. This is the word. Ashrabu. 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 Yes, Ashrabu. Or you can say Ashrab. Ashrab. So you can combine this with Anna just now. So we say Anna Ashrab. Anna Ashrab. Anna Ashrab. I am drinking or I drink. Anna Ashrab. So we have three verbs now. Azhab, I go. Adros, I study. Azhab, uh, sorry, Ashrab. I drink, Ashrab. Next word, next verb. Next verb is sleep. You want to say I sleep. Okay, this is the word. Anamu. 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 Yes. Anamu. Yes. Or you can just say Anam. Anam. So again, you skip the last vowel. Anam. So both are correct. Anamu, anam. You can combine this with ana just now. Sorry. You combine this with ana. With this word, ana. So we say, ana. Sorry. Ana, anamu. Ana, anamu. Ana, anamu. I sleep. All right? Ana, anamu. Yes, good. Ana, anamu. I sleep. And the last verb, the last verb for today is to say I eat or eat. The word eat is this. Okay, you look at this word. So this is a, ah, but you see this symbol? Uh, this is the long vowel. This is actually similar to this one. But this is a short one. A, ah, anamu, anamu. But this is, if you see this one, now nah, this is the long vowel. So instead of a, ah, we say a. Ah. Ah, so here the word is akulu. 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 
Akulu. Yes. Or you can say akul. akul. Good. You can say akul. We combine with the word ana just now. So we say ana akul. Ana akul. All right? So these are the six verbs uh, that we learned today. Azhab, I go. Adros, I study. Ashrab, I drink. Anam, I sleep. And akul, I eat. All right? Okay. Any questions so far for the first one? What are the similarities that you can see here for all these words? Ana. Ana. Okay, that is number one. Ana. Yes, these are all for Ana. Good. What else? First letter is A. First letter is A. Thank you, Abdullah. Shukran. If you notice, the first letter, it is always A. Azhab. Adrus. Ashrab. Anam. A. So this is how you say I. I do this. I do that. You start with A, 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 Anam, and uh, Ashrab, Adrus, and so on. Okay? So this is very important, the A, the A. All right? So number two, what is also important here? So just now when we practice, we say we combine the word Ana and one on, on all of these verbs. So you say Ana, Azhab, Ana, Adrus, and so on, Ana, Akul. But actually, you can skip this word Ana. You can just say Azhab. Because you start with A, everybody understand it is I. So you don't have to say Ana Azhabu anymore. You can just say Azhab. Azhab. So Azhab means I go. How do you know it is I and not he and not she? Because of the A. Do you get that? So A here, it has the, some uh, intrinsic meaning. That means I. So Azhab, for example, we say Azhab ila jami'ah. I go to the jamia. I go. You don't have to say ana azhab ila jamia. But if you say ana azhab, that is also correct. So you have the option, right? So the same for adros. Adros fi jamia. I study in the university. Adros fi jamia. Okay. Ashrab. I drink. So you can find in the dictionary. How do you say water? Ashrab. Okay. And then find the word water. You combine. Ashrab ma, for example. Ashrab ma. All right? So you can try to, you can explore uh, the vocabularies on your own. Combine and use all these words. Anam, I sleep. Anam, I sleep. So maybe you can uh, make a simple sentence. For example, you want to say, oh, I sleep in the room. Or I sleep at night. Just simple sentence. Okay? Ana, and then you go to the dictionary and find how to say at night. Okay. Or oh, how to say in the room. Anam fi gurfa. Okay, so we are going to learn all this word. Don't worry. And the last one, akul, I eat. So again, you find another word. Uh, you eat, what do you eat? I eat rice, for example. So find the word rice. Ruz. Akul, ruz. Or another word, a chicken, dajaj. Akul, dajaj, and so on. All right? So this is how you use the word azhab for Anna. That is number one. Now, we go for the second one. We go for, uh, okay, let us skip this anta and anti. We go straight to huwa first. Okay, because this is a bit easier. Anti, uh, you will have to add uh, some something at the end of the verb, so it might confuse you. So, let us go to the, we have done this. We go to this one. We go straight to huwa, he. Right? So, how do you say he? He goes or he studies, he drinks, he sleeps, and he eats. Okay. Just now, when you say Ana, you start with A, Azhab, ak, uh, Adarus, Ashrab. Now you want to say Huwa, you start with Ya. Again, for Huwa, for He, you change the verbs to Ya. You start with Ya. So, for example, just now, Azhab, Azhab, you change to Ya. So, it becomes Yazhab. Yazhab. Yazhabu. You get that? Just now, for Ana, we say Azhabu. A. Now, for Huwa, we change A to Ya. So, we say Yazhabu. Yazhabu. Huwa, Yazhab. Huwa, Yazhab. He goes. Huwa, Yazhab, Ila, Jamia. 
Okay. Uh, Ustaz. Yes. Uh, the is it the same for continuous tense or past tense or present tense? It's the same word. Past tense, no. Past tense, no. Past tense is different. This is only for present and present continuous. Ah, uh, okay, sir. Yes, this is only. Thank you for for your asking. Uh, this is only for present and present continuous, not for past tense. Past tense later. Okay. We today we only learn. But I didn't I didn't mention anything about uh, the the term. The how do you say past tense? No, I don't. I do not want to mention that for now. We just want to use the words in the sentences. Okay, sir. Yes. Thank you, Sayyid. Okay. So again, this is uh, for huwa, you change to ya. So huwa, yazhab. We go to the second verb. Just now we say adrus, I study. Adrus. So how do you say he studies? Change the a to ya. So adrus becomes yadrus. 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 So we say, huwa yadrusu, or huwa yadrus, he studies. Huwa yadrus fi jami'ah, he study in the university, or he is studying in the university, depend on the context. Whether you translate it as he studies or he is studying, it will depend on the context. Okay, yes. The next word, ashrab, I drink. Now you want to say he drinks, the same word, ashrab, you just change a to ya. So now we say, Yashrabu, 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 Yashrab, Yashrab. He drinks. Okay. So the ya part is for he. Yashrab. The next word. So, uh, yes. sir, just want to add uh, in front also can write huwa yashrabu. Yes. Also good. Uh, yes. You can also add this huwa. Yes. Just like when we use ana, you can add ana to the front of the verb. Ana azhabu. The same thing. You can say huwa yazhabu. Yes, correct. So you can say huwa yazhab. Or you can skip huwa. You can just say yazhab. Then that is for huwa as well. So you have two options. Huwa yazhab or you just say yazhab. Huwa yadrus or just yadrus. Huwa yashrab or you just say yashrab. Alright. The next word, sleep. Anamu. Anamu. So change the R to Ya. Anamu becomes Yanamu. 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 Yanam. Yanam, we say. Hua Yanam. Hua Yanam. What is he doing? Hua Yanam. He is sleeping. Hua Yanam. And the last one. Eat. Eat. Just now we say Akul. Akul. Okay, look at this. When you say Hua, we say yakul, yakul, yakul. Uh, it is not yakul, it is not yakul, it is yakul. You have this uh sound. Yakul, yakulu, yakulu. All right? So yakulu, huwa yakulu, he eats. Yakulu, aruz, he eats rice. Yakulu, dajaj, he eats chicken. All right? So this is for the second one for huwa. Okay, any questions? Ana, you say a. Ah. This one. Huwa, you say ya. Yeah. And the rest, the verb is similar. Right. Any questions? No? Okay. If there's no question, we go to the third one. Okay, now we move to he, ya, she. Okay, how to say he, ya? For ana, you say a. Ah. For hua, you say ya. Yeah. For hia, we say ta. Ta. So for the word azhabu, it becomes tazhabu. Tazhabu. Again, azhabu for me, I go. Yazhabu, he goes. Tazhabu, she goes. So we say tazhabu. So you can combine and you say hia tazhabu. Hia tazhab. She goes, ilal jamia. Hiya tazhab ila jamia. Or you can skip the word here. You just say tazhab ila jamia. She goes to the jamia. Okay. So, so here, hiya, hiya, is it hiya? Yes. Hiya. Yes. Ha. The H sound. Yes. Correct. Hiya. Hiya tazhab. Hiya tazhab. Okay. The next one for the word tadros. Adros, adros, so me, I. Yadros, 
she. Now you want to say she, you change to ta. So adros becomes tadros. 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 So we say hiya tadros. Hiya tadros. Hiya tadros. Uh, what do you learn? Hiya tadros kanun. Kanun is law. Hiya tadros kanun. Hiya tadros. She learns or she studies. Ashrab. I drink becomes tashrab. 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 Hiya tashrab. She drinks. Okay, so you change to hiya, you change to ta. Anamu. Anamu. I sleep. You change to hiya. Tanamu. Tanamu. So we say hiya tanamu. Hiya tanamu. She is sleeping. Hiya tanamu fi lail at night. Hiya tanam. Anam becomes tanam. And the last one, I eat. Akulu. Just now, when we say he eats, you change to ya, but we say ya kulu, ya kulu, and now you change to he ya, you tak change al. to ta. Yes, really? Tak, tak, tak kulu. Tak kulu, good. You say tak kulu, yes. So we say tak kulu. He ya tak kul. He ya tak kul. He ya tak kul samak. Samak is fish. He ya tak kul. Samak. All right. So this is uh, for the domir for the pronoun hiya. So now you have three. A for ana, azhabu. For huwa, we say ya, yazhabu. And for hiya, you say ta, tazhabu. All right. So a, ya, and ta. You have three. Now we go for number four. Number four, we want to say nahnu. You want to say nahnu. Okay, nahnu is we. All right. So how do you say we? We do, we go, we study, and so on. Okay. So now we use another sound. Just now we say a, azhabu, tazhabu, yazhabu. And for we, we say na. 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 So this is the na. So azhabu becomes nazhabu. 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 Nahnu nazhabu. Nahnu nazhabu ila jami'ah. Nahnu nazhabu ila jami'ah. We are going to the university. Correct? Right? So you add na. So you have now the fourth sound, na. Adrusu, I study. Now you want to say we study. Change to na. Adrusu, nadrusu. 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 So nadrus, we study. You can combine with nahnu. Nahnu, sorry. Nahnu nadrus. Nahnu nadrus. Nahnu nadrus fi jamia. We are studying in the university. The third word, ashrab, I drink. How do you say we drink? Ashrab, now change to we drink. Change to na. Nashrabu. Nashrabu, yes. Thank you. For ashrabu becomes nashrabu. So we say nashrabu, nashrabu, nashrabu alma. We drink water. Nashrabu alma, nashrabu ma. Ma is water. Naam. So nahnu nashrabu, we drink. And then we sleep. Anamu, I sleep is anamu. He sleeps, yanamu. You, uh, she sleeps, tanamu. Now you want to change to we sleep. Nanamu, nanamu. Again, from anamu, change the a to na, so it becomes nanamu, nanamu. Nahnu nanamu fil gurfa. Nahnu nanamu, we sleep fi gurfa. Gurfa means room, we sleep in the room. Nahnu nanam, all right? So this is for the word sleep. And the last verb is akulu, just now. Akulu, yakulu, takulu. So now you change to na. Nakulu, na yes, good, yes. So we say nakulu, okay. So we say nakulu. So nakulu is we eat. All right. So these are the four uh, basic sounds, uh, four basic letters that you add to the verb. If you want to say I, what is the sound? Ah. If you want to say you, sorry. If you want to say uh, we, we change to na. If you want to say he, we change to ya. And if you want to say she, you change to ta. 
So these are the four basic uh, letters for the fa'al mudari. Uh, sorry, for the present tense. For the present tense. Okay. So these are the four. Okay. Any questions so far for these four? So what is mudari? Ah, okay. Thank you. Mudari is the term to refer to present tense. Oh, okay. Yes. But for this level, we are not interested in introducing the, the terms uh, unless we have uh, you have learned some a good amount of uh, word vocabulary uh, later on yes we can introduce the term okay sir okay but that is good if you can pick up the, the term mudare so mudare is referring to present tense yes okay so now we have completed the first four and finally we have the last two ah uh, so now this is also important you want to see you because you want you will you will you will ask your friends so uh, where do you go what do you eat and so on right so for anta and anti okay let us look at anta 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 if we want to say anta it is the same word you just use ta anta we use ta this is similar to which one so anta we say tazhabu this is similar to which one just now is it similar to ana or hiya or huwa or nahnu Uh, the second one, sir. The second one, which is? He. Uh, hua. He, yeah. hua. Hua is ya. Yeah. Hua, we say ya. Yeah. Hua, yazhab. But this time, it is tazhab. Uh, so, it is not the second one, not hua. It is similar to he, ya. Yeah. You see this? For he, yeah, we say ta. For anta, we also say ta. So basically, for anta, the word is similar to hiya. So we say tazhabu. Similar to hiya tazhabu, anta tazhabu. But the meaning is now different. Hiya tazhabu is for she. Anta tazhabu is for you. So how do you differentiate whether it is she or anta? Then you will depend on the content. Context. Look at the context. Okay, if it is about a woman, then of course it means she, yeah. Tazhabu, she goes. But if it is a conversation between people, then of course it will be anta, tazhabu, right? So you can now, you know, tazhabu, so it can be used for both. Either anta or she, yeah. So you look at the content, context, sorry, look at the context, then you will be able to decide whether it is for, for anta or it is for she, yeah. So... Basically, it is similar to here. So we say tazhabu, anta tazhabu, for ana for adrusu. Study you say anta tadrusu, similar to here. Here tadrusu, anta tadrus, anta tadrus. So for example, you want to ask a question. What do you study? What do you study? Maza tadrus. You can use this word. Maza tadrus. Maza tadrus. And then you, you will respond. Oh, I study. So how do you say I study? This one, right? Uh, so you can respond. Oh, I study. Adrus. So it will involve uh, the skill of changing this. A ah, or ta or ya and also na. Okay. This is for tadrus. Drink. Tashrab. Just like she drinks. Tashrab. So anta. Tashrab. What do you drink? Maza. Tashrab. Tashrab. Nah. The next one. Sleep. Tanamu, tanamu, just like tanamu for here, for she, tanamu, anta tanamu. Okay. For example, I ask you, when do you sleep? We are going to learn how, how, how what are all, all of these words. What, when, uh, where, okay, uh, until the end. So tanamu, you sleep. And the last one, eat, akulu becomes takulu. 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 You eat. Maza takul. What do you eat? Maza takul. Akul dajaj. Akul dajaj. I eat chicken. Okay. So this is anta. So basically for anta, there's nothing new. It is similar to kia. You just change from azhabu to yazhabu. Okay. From adrusu to tadrusu. That is for anta. Okay. So done for anta. So we have the last one. The last one is anti. 
Ah, now I'm talking to a female, you. Ah, okay, for auntie, okay, please um, look at this carefully. For auntie, for auntie, okay, we, oh, we still use ta, similar to anta. Anta, tazhabu, auntie, we say ta as well. So you say ta. That is number one. You say ta. Tazhab. But in the end, in the end, we have additional sound. In the end, you will add in, in, ina. So the word tazhab, tazhab becomes tazhabina. Tazhabina. Okay, you can repeat after me. Tazhabina. 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 Yes. That not binna. Tazhabina. Tazhabina. Yes. Or you can just say tazhabin. You skip this last vowel. Tazhabin. Tazhabin. So you end the word with in. In. Tazhabin. Tazhab for male. You. Tazhabin. So you just add tazhab. Tazhabin. All right. So this is for auntie. For you, female, we add tazhabin. We add the in sound in the end. So in is this. Represented by this ya and nun. So this ya is the long vowel, tazhabi, and this is the nun, na, tazhabina or tazhabin. For adrus, just now, study. I study adrus. You study tadrus. Tadrus. What about you for female? The same word, tadrus, tadrus, but you add in in the end. So it becomes tadrusin. 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 So we say, Maza Tadrusin. What do you study? Maza Tadrusin. Okay, Tadrusin. To drink. Ashrab, I drink. Ashrab, I drink. Tashrab, you drink. Tashrab, you drink. Okay, what about you for female? The same word, Tashrab. Tashrab, but you end with in. So it becomes Tashrabin. Tashrabin. Anti. Tashrabin. So you can use with the the pronoun anti. Anti Tashrabin. Or you just say Tashrabin. So when you hear this in in the end, you know it is for a female. And the last one is to sleep. Ana anam. Anta tanam. Anti tanam. The same word. Tanamin. But you end it with mean. Anti tanamin. Anti tanamin. You sleep for female. Okay, anti tanamin. And the last verb is I eat. Akul. Akul. You eat. Takul. Takul. You eat for female. Takul. The same word. Takul. But you end it with in. Takulina. 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 Takulin. Okay, so takulin is you eat. Yes. So these are the changes. Okay, the six changes that you should know for the six uh, pronoun, for the basic pronoun. Anta, anti, huwa, kia, ana, and also nahnu. All right. Any questions so far? No, sir. Okay. If there is no question, let us try to, uh, let us memorize this together. Okay. Let us do this together. We start with uh, the verb. Azhab. Okay, we start with the verb azhab. So I will mention the pronoun. I will mention the pronoun and you give me the sound, the verb. So whether it start with a or ta or na or ya. Okay, so let us start with the first word azhab. Azhab. So try without looking the notes, try to listen to me. Azhab is for Anna. Anna azhab. How do you say he goes? Azhab, I go. Ana, Azhab. What about Hua? Yes, what about Hua? For this word, Azhab. You want to say Hua? Yes. Yazhabu. Yazhabu, yes. So Azhab, you change to Yazhab. Good. Hua, Yazhab. All right, thank you. What about Anta? Ana, Azhab. Hua, Yazhab. Anta. 
Anta. Tazhab. Tazhab. Yes, good. Anta. Tazhab. Yes, Anta. Tazhab. Good. Nahnu. We. Nahnu. Ana azhab. Na? Nazhab. Nazhab. Yes. Nahnu. Nazhab. Good. Nahnu. Nazhab. All right. Now, hiya. Ana azhab. Hiya. Hiya. What is the sound? The, the first sound. Uh, hiya. Tazhab. Tazhab. Yes. Good. Or tazhabu. Yes. Hiya. Tazhab. Hiya. Tazhab. Good. And finally, anti, anti, yeah. this is for female, you for female, anti. So for anti, it involves another addition in, at the end. Taz hab bin. Taz hab bin. Taz hab bin. Yes, taz hab bin. Don't stop, don't say taz hab bin. No, join, join them. Taz hab bin. Taz hab bin. Yes, taz hab bin. Okay. So this is for tazhab. So you can practice this. Azhab is for ana. Yazhab is huwa, huwa yazhab. So you join, you use this together with the pronoun so that you memorize both of them. Hiya, uh, hiya, hiya tazhab. Anta, anta tazhab. Ana, ana azhab. Nahnu, nahnu, nahnu nazhab. Okay? So you can try this. The same goes to the other verbs. Adros. I say adros. Okay, let us try the, this one. Before we move to the next topic, we, we do this. Adros, ana adros. Ana Adros, I study. Ha, now you want to say, uh, she studies. And uh, here, Ana Adros here. Ah, ta, I give you the clue. Here, ta. Adros here. Taz, Tazros. Tadros. Tadros. Yes, here Tadros. Good. Hua, hua. For the same word, hua. Hua yadros. Yadros, good. Uh, change to anta. Anta, uh, you. Ad adrosu. An that is ana. Ana adros. That is for I. Now I want anta, you. Anta. Anta. Tadrosu. Tadrosu. Anta tadros, yes. Anta tadros, good. Anti. Anti. Anti is similar to anta, yes, I mean, you want to say? Tad, uh, anti, tadrosu, or? Ah, tadrosu is for anta. Tadrosu in. Tadrosu in. No, no, nah, yes, not tadrosu in, but tadrosin. You combine the last S, -S tadrosin. Ah, tadrosin, yes, tadrosin. Tadros is for anta, now it is for anti, so you say tadrosin, tadrosin. And the last one, nahnu, we, we study. Nadrus. Nadrus, yes, correct. All right. So this is, the, these are the changes. Uh, the term we use it is the conjugation, verb conjugation of uh, the of the verb for the six domir, okay, for the, the six pronoun. All right. So uh, practice this. So in the next class, we will try to ask, Question. We, we, we try to have question and answer session where you use all these verbs and we, I will give you some uh, words that you can use to ask question and also to answer. But the purpose is to practice with all this. Okay. But you need to practice before we come to the next session, inshallah. All right. So uh, then with this part, the fi'el, the verb, the verb and also the pronoun. Okay. The six important uh, pronouns.